morning guys. We've come down to the waterfront today and we're heading out. We're doing some paddling. We're going out on the kayaks with Atlantic Outlook, which is the kayaking tour company that Ben set up. This is Jordan and Tom behind me, carrying the boats. And then we've got everyone in front, we've got a big group. And uh, I'm pumped, I'm excited. I'm hoping we'll see some dolphins, but I guess that's not guaranteed. What's the percentage chance of seeing dolphins, you reckon? 99.9. Really? Yeah. Woo! Okay, <laughs> that's cool. Everyone's getting in the kayaks. That's all the girls are doing today, yeah? Dolphins already! Oh my god! Look at them! Oh my god! Oh, it's happening behind us! Oh! Oh my god, that's amazing! <laughs> so quickly! I thought we were going to be looking for ages and they're right there! How are you feeling, Raya? Oh! Oh! Oh my god! This is already one of the best things I've done in Cape Town. Yeah. I can't really steer with my feet with it. This is the best 360 camera hands down. Oh, life is good. What's that? Yeah, nice. Yeah. How old are you guys? 34. I'm, I'm like two years above Ben. We went to school together. right behind you. Are you filming? Oh my gosh, there! <gasps> hey buddy! Oh. And in front of you! Oh. No! Look at it! Oh my gosh! <gasps> oh my gosh! <laughs> It's one of the most magical feelings, having dolphins swimming around you. Yeah. Back on land. <laughs> How's that, Kyle? That was pretty epic. You I can't wait to see the footage. I know, oh my god. <laughs> they literally swam under the boat. <laughs> right, we're back. We just dropped our life jackets off. And we are heading to lunch now. Also, I'm back on the, on the Sony. What did you guys think of the fusion footage? Hopefully we captured a lot of stuff. I was just, I was saying whilst we're out there, it's so good because no matter where the dolphins popped up, I was filming them. It's good, it's good 
filming with the directionless camera. Okay, we're in this cafe called Nourish, and this is amazing. I can't believe I've just found out about this place. We've just got these bowls. This is the moonshine bowl with falafel. This is the glitter shine bowl. Is this a glitter shine bowl? Yes, extra broccoli. Oh. Oh, yeah. What's this bowl? That's a glitter shine. Glitter shine, yeah. yeah. Thank you so much. And then we got some avo toast, watermelon juice, like the most incredible smoothies. This is like, I have, we have to come back here. Like, oh yeah. See you later, guys. All right, we're heading out on a Instagram mission today. Check out some new spots. Ah, oh, Kyle is our tour guide, our photo location tour guide. Yes, hopefully, hopefully we've got some good spots. Where, where are you taking us first? Uh, let's go to Deer Park. Yeah. yeah. So we're going for a little stroll now through Deer Park. I, uh, I remember to take my like my bandana headband off because I get like the worst suntan line if I don't. Oh, cool! Ah. Oh. Hey guys! <laughs> guys, we're following this little river up a bit further, but we're just, Kyle was just saying, this is fresh water, and at the moment, this is joining, this is going a bit further downstream, joining up with some other fresh water, and it's not being utilized for this water crisis right now in the way that it could be. And we've just been chatting about why that is. Is it just bad infrastructure? Is there like a deeper conspiracy? of why Cape Town's in such a crisis right now. Oh, by the way, if you're just watching this vlog and I haven't watched my previous vlogs and don't know about Cape Town, they are in an urgent water shortage. At this point, I think they're due to like, when well, the taps are getting turned off in April, right? But actually, yeah, I think it's the 12th of April is the date that they've decided to cut everything. Yeah. No order. And I want to do like a longer, I'm trying to plan like a, a longer, more concise video about or maybe a shorter video, but anyway, more concise video about the water crisis and what's really happening and what it means for locals and stuff. So I'm trying to just wrap my head around it, but it's kind of baffling how it's happened. Um, I'll keep you guys posted though. Oh, let me know in the comments what you specifically want to know about this water crisis, because as a tourist that's come in, like obviously we've tried to adopt what all the locals are doing, limiting ourselves to 50 litres a day, um, two minute showers, all those kind of things. But yeah, let us know what you want to know because then I'll go and do some research. I want it to be a bit more informed than my normal vlogs where my guess is as good as yours a lot of the time. Okay, we've just arrived at a place called Glen Beach. This is right next to Camps Bay. Or well, it's in Camps Bay. Um, yeah, we're just checking out some beach locations. We're trying to plan in a, just a beach day where we can just come and chill and um, yeah, do some sunbathing. I've already caught a bit of sun today from earlier when we were kayaking, so uh, I need to be careful. We've just reapplied sun cream though, which is good. burnt my shoulder. Kyle, can you just hold the cameras there? I'm gonna turn around. Is it crazy? Yes. It's just white and red. Pretty much. Is yeah. it like classic British tourist lobster? <laughs> Welcome cool. to Cape Town. You got the Cape Town tattoo. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, let that be a lesson for you. If you go kayaking, wear plenty of sun cream or maybe even wear like a long shirt. Maybe that would have been a better option. So we are driving along the coast and we've stopped at Pebbles Beach and this is pretty cool, there's like a coffee, a little coffee van on the beach here so we're just getting a cheeky little coffee. Kyle filmed like a, a video, actually it's the first video you put on your YouTube channel isn't Correct, it? Correct it is. It, it was with the Mavic Air which you saw me testing out the other day. He did a lot better video um, and he filmed a lot of it around here like a lot of cool shots with the pebbles and stuff. It was pretty. Yeah it was cool man. 
That was a good video. And we got seals, yeah. and mountains, and all the things. Yeah, go and check it out. Subscribe to Kyle. He's only just started his YouTube channel, so he needs a bit of uh, our support, guys. So go and show him some love. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Next stop, Cozy Bay. There's some seals we've seen out on the rock, which look cool. I might get the drone out and go over there with the drone. Yeah, this is cozy. photo location scouting mission up and down and now we've got back to Camps Bay where we're gonna chill get a drink we might get some dinner here later um, and then hoping for a pretty epic sunset guys we messed up our timing a little bit the plan was we were gonna eat at this bar and then run out and get the sunset do some photos but the Sun is literally moments away from setting we are ready to head out now but I'm just trying to recover because I I put this chili, um, chopped chilies all over my pizza and I am like dying right now. Um, I th still think we can get some good shots though. I think we run out there and the sky is looking incredible. You guys ready? Ready. Let's do it. I think we've got this. Huh? I think we've got this if you walk around the other side. back home it's been an incredible day guys if you are in Cape Town you absolutely have to do the Atlantic Outlook kayaking tour um, I'll link them below um, yeah so much fun and it's Ben's company um, it's awesome that he set it up well done bro it's it's fantastic honestly it's like one of the best things I've done can't believe we got to kayak with dolphins unbelievable um, yeah, we checked out some cool um, spots as well, definitely, um, yeah, I was just buzzing all day, just at the views and being on the coast and the sunset and I guess the only bad thing that happened today was my sunburn, but you know, I just need to learn, double check, I'm applying sun cream everywhere, um, sweet, well, I will catch you guys in the morning, peace out, enjoy life, live the adventure. Boom.